What's going on you guys? It's your favorite barber, your favorite people. David D. Sharp coming to you live once again from the Sharp Zone. I want to make a quick video to thank everybody that took their time yesterday to stop by my Facebook page and wish me happy birthday. That meant a lot to me. And I really want to take the time out to really thank those that saw my birthday wish, uh, me sharing my Oscar beard and grooming uh, GoFundMe campaign. And those that either you just viewed the, uh, the campaign, you, you left a comment, and especially to those that invested into Oscar Beard and Room. But mainly yesterday I spent a lot of time thinking, writing some new goals, some new dreams down, and really taking my past year and comparing it to now, uh, comparing contrast to now, um, really thinking about where I want to be in life. Where do I want to go in life? What type of people do I want in my life? What type of business ventures do I want to create? What type of business ventures do I want to get involved with? What type of lifestyle do I want? Thinking also about what type of lifestyle do I want to not only give myself, but to my family, my children's 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 children. Well, you get the point. Really when this thought came into mind, during a conversation I had last week, and that conversation was, I am nine years away from being 40. So with that being said, I took the time out from Sunday night, throughout Monday, just writing out new goals, new dreams, things I want to accomplish, things I want to manifest, things that I know that I've been yearning for, um, to, to accomplish, to expand, to grow in, and things that I know I need to invest into now so when that time comes, I'm not I don't have any worries. I don't have anything to have to uh, double check back because a lot of times, most people overlook even the smallest things in life that later on in life will become a big issue. Don't get me wrong, I am not where I want to be. I, I haven't accomplished certain things that I even, my last birthday, I set out to accomplish. I got close to it, but not exactly what I want. But I'm going to continue to push to become a, a better barber, a better entrepreneur, uh, a better uh, person, a better father, a better lover, a better son, in various of ways that I could possibly be. As we all know, life happens, shit happens, but at the same time, I'm the type of person that has grown out of the emotional bubble of running and hiding from our situations. And just becoming the type of man where I'm just tackling shit head on, whether if it's it's accomplished the way I want it to, or it's done the way it needed to be done, or just in this situation, I did the best that I could. Everybody out there that did wish me happy birthday is taking the time and effort to really look at their lives as well too. Are you the person that you wanna be? Are you in, in the situation, the best situation for yourself? Are you doing what you want and love to do? Or are you just going with however life puts you in whatever situation? And this video isn't just for me and just for me saying to all of those that wish me happy birthday, but even if you didn't wish me happy birthday and you ran across this video, I hope this gets your cogs in your mind to start working and start thinking about certain things that maybe you need to start doing now so the future you can thank the past you for doing what you did. But with that being said, don't beat yourself up if you did not accomplish exactly to the T, dot, crossing your T's and dotting your I's, if you didn't do exactly what you want to do, don't give up. Don't give in to the emotion of, oh, I didn't accomplish it, so I'm just gonna give up and give in to the emotion at that one point in time. Don't do it. Trust me, 
later on you were going to wish that you continue pushing through what you was going through and don't just go through grow, grow through your situations pick up some books that may give you some insight on certain things that you want to do certain situations that you are going through have gone through and maybe the things that you have gone through you really didn't learn from the situation but it can help you learn from the situation and elevate your consciousness to a position that you need to be mentally physically spiritually financially all those lead levels <laughs> anywho i appreciate everybody stopping by thanking me uh, uh wishing me happy birthday um and if those that really want to uh invest into oscar beard and grooming uh, i will leave the link in the description and again to those that have invested before and yesterday i really thank you a lot it really means so much to me and the future of oscar beard and grooming but until next time, peace, stay sharp.